right at about 40 acres, 31.8 of uh, deeded, and then it does border tribal land on two sides, and there's uh, eight acres of tribal land that'll be added as an addition. We grow a variety of different heirloom vegetables, and uh, we have heritage chickens. We do, uh, we're getting back into mushrooms. We try to go full circle with the vegetables where we save the seed and then um, we have another source of income. We sell the seed. Hopefully we can get more heirloom varieties out there. One of the reasons he, he fell in love with this place is he could tell that the soil was really good. The other thing was that it was bordered on two sides by tribal land, so that made him really happy. And when we went to the courthouse and we started digging through the records and the deeds and everything, we found that it was Cherokee land. There was one man who went when it was taken away from the Cherokee and he purchased a lot of land. Then he sold it to a loving good family who held it in their family for over a hundred years. But the tribal land is actually Cherokee land that they won back in court that was taken away from them. It's the Henson donation. So he just really felt at home when he was here. And so that's why he's flying his Cherokee flag back there, is he's reclaimed it. Well, it's said the Cherokee were the original farmers of this area. The way they introduce the seed and bring these uh, seed back to our people, it's, it's, it's part of our culture. It's part of, of who we are, and it's important to give people how techniques were done with farming. They can learn the plants, the animals. This is a French black copper Moran rooster, and uh, this is one of the breeds that lays the dark chocolate eggs claim that they're the very best tasting eggs. And the French have feathers on their feet. Working with Extension is like working with family. They're always there to help answer questions on anything that we have. They let us know different programs that are available. The Garden Kit program is a, is a perfect example. So what the Longs have done is they are preserving, promoting, farming and showing that you can still make a living doing these things and so we hope that younger generations will see farming as a, a way to make a living. Look what I got. I got an egg. You know, grow something you like to eat and uh, or raise something, you know, an animal that you like. Make sure you've got a tractor. It, it is a really uh, freer lifestyle because you make your choices, but then you reap what you sow.